Hi there everybody, this is Miss Nelson again, and today we are doing lesson 3.5 in our 4th grade Florida Go Math book. Lesson 3.5 is about multiplying with re regrouping. And basically, the, the book here, it tells us to do this with partial products. So basically multiplying the tens and then the ones. Um, and that's fine. We've done that. We've done partial products over the past two lessons, lesson 3.4 and 3.3. So today I'm just going to do the traditional way of multiplying with regrouping. So that's why I'm showing you this sheet right here. So we're going to first estimate before we find the real answer. So in order to estimate number 2 here, we'll round 73 to 70 and 28 to 30, and then we'll multiply. We're going to do our basic fact of 7 times 3, which is 21, and then add our two zeros. So 2,100 is our estimate. Then we're going to do our real problem. And the way that I tell my class to do this is I, pret I say pretend like that 2 is not there in the tens place. Just ignore it for now. And you're going to multiply just like you would by a regular one-digit number. So our first is 8 times 3, which is 24. Put the 4 here and carry the 2. And then we have 8 times 7, which is 56, plus the 2 that we carried, so 58. Now, I always tell my kids, the next step is to cross out what you regroup so you don't get confused and put a zero as a placeholder here in the ones place because we're going to move to multiply the two, which is in the tens place. So our first answer needs to go into the tens place and not the ones place. That's why we need the zero there as a placeholder. So then our first problem is two times three, which is six, and two times seven, which is four. 14. Now that we have our 2, we're going to add them together. 4 plus 0 is 4. 8 plus 6 is 14. Carry my 1. 5 plus 1 plus 4 is 10. Carry my 1. 1 plus 1 is 2. So we get the real answer of 2044 which we can look at our estimate and see that it's close, so we know that's a reasonable answer. Okay, so this is what you're going to be doing in my class for Lesson 3.5. You're going to be estimating and then finding the real answer just by a traditional way of multiplying with regrouping. If you're in my class, what I want you to do is write down in your planner the secret word is butter. And then that way that will let me know that you have listened to this whole movie. And if you have any questions, feel free to leave me a comment. Thanks. Bye.